we are great believers in free media and any engagement that puts the media in danger is not acceptable. However, in the context of the violent demonstrations, you agree that there has been a lot of violence against citizens, many citizens, properties, burning or down of buildings, you know, including churches. In that confusion, there could have been incidences where the media was caught in the fray. I do not think there is any deliberate attack on the media. And if there was such deliberate attack on the media, I can tell you we would be opposed to it and we would not support it and we would actually uh, deal with it because we believe that the media should be left to carry out its duties, its uh, broadcasts, irrespective of how unfair they may be. It doesn't really matter. But the media should be left alone, irrespective of how biased they may be. Okay. Any other maneno? And just for the record, because I have seen some other people say, oh, maybe the media will be, I don't know what will be switched off. Take it from me. Kenya has come a long way. The eras of, the era of uh, switching off, I don't know, this or that, that, that's way behind us. I have said we will support the right of the media to carry out its function. You have our absolute support, irrespective of how biased you are against us. We will support you. Yeah? We will support you to do whatever it is that you are doing. But uh, I am sure if we exchange positions, if you are standing where I am standing, you guys would have switched off the media. But us, we will not. Sawa. Santin.